Well, we came across a problem with a car with an aluminum radiator that was building up extreme pressure in the system. Even overnight, the next day, we had extreme pressure in the hoses. Uh, we called Ron Davis Radiator, and they helped us with this problem. Uh, they've seen this before. What it is is the aluminum and the metals and the coolant are creating electrolysis. And if you can see in here, this radiator, you had a lot of buildup in here. Uh, what happens with the electrolysis, these tubes, and the, these tubes is where your coolant runs through and it cools through the fins and the pressure starts popping these little fins because you have erosion and the pressure, you end up having to replace the radiator. So the signs of electrolysis are extreme pressure in your cooling system, kind of an acid smell in your coolant, possibly overheating, leaking. Uh, with the pressure, you may end up starting to see gaskets start weep like your water pump gasket, intake manifold gasket. If you have an engine with aluminum heads, if you have electrolysis going on in your radiator, the same thing's gonna happen with your heads and your manifold and it will literally eat the metal away. In order to fix this, uh, ground straps on your radiator to your core support, ground straps on your engine to your frame, ground straps on your engine to your body. Uh, Ron Davis also sells a ground kit, uh, and basically all it is is wires with eyelets on the end. One other step that we've done, and we've talked to, to Ron Davis on this too, uh, Justin Brothers makes a chemical that goes into the coolant and it reduces the chances of uh, electrolysis. This is a good product and they, they um, recommend that. Um, you should flush your radiator at least every two years. You should use distilled water when you mix it with your coolant. I can demonstrate to you how you can check it with a simple voltmeter and what, what the parameters are for voltage. Hook up your negative to your negative side of your battery, and you're gonna drop your end of your other, of your positive end only into the coolant. Don't touch the radiator or any metal. <clears throat> and as you can see, this is dropping down, and we're at 0 0.023. Now, again, zero to 0.3 is acceptable. And right now we're almost getting it. it, it will roll down as 0, .0, well, we're down to zero now. So this cooling system is raring to go and trouble free for the heat of Arizona. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, we are gonna have more of these uh, information uh, videos. Uh, please subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on Facebook and Instagram. If you have any problems you would like us to uh, investigate or talk about, please message us on Facebook. Um, we'd be happy to see what we can do and to help you out.